Started heading over to the rostrum now, won't be long before they're called in. And the six strong field begin to get themselves organized. Start uh, about to climb the rostrum steps. They're a little ahead of him at present, but he's going up now. Seamus O'Neill calls them forward. And they're off. For this turn to follow Old Roan Chase and Monet's Garden bounds in to an early lead with Watch My Back dropped out in the early stages. They close in on and safely negotiate the first. So Monet's Garden out in front with ears pricked swiftly down towards the second, being pursued by I'm Singing the Blues with a noseband. Alberta's run on the far side, near side Pocala in the Stewart family colours, and then Tartak and finally Watch My Back. On to the third, which is the first of the ditches. And Monet's Garden with ears pricked, jumping boldly from Pocana. Tartak threw the top in fourth place, didn't get very high. Watch my back is already eight or ten lengths adrift, running from out of the weights here and struggling to keep up this brisk early gallop set by Monet's Garden. They've taken the fourth. So leaving the back straight. Monet's Garden from Pocana. Then I'm singing the blues. Alberta's run out wide, close up in fourth place, tracked by a Tartak, who made that niggly little mistake early on. And they break back to uh, watch my back, uh, some 10 or 12 lengths. Going to the cross fence, taken along the side of the course. Monet's Garden in close on that occasion, and Tartak again far from fluent. Watch my back himself, not very high and last. And Monet's Garden leads them in from Pocala. Monet's Garden in the hands today of Dougie Costello. Barry Geraghty on board 12 months ago, but on Pocala today in second place currently. I'm singing the blues of the noseman in the centre. Old leap there from Monet's Garden. Tartak much better. Alberta's run away to the left close up. And this break to watch my back. Moving on to the second of the ditches. Fence seven in total. Monet's Garden with four right on his heels. I'm singing the blues in the centre. Pocking out towards the far side and away to the left. Alberta's run a couple of lengths to Tartak and watch my back continues some way remote. Steadily approaching halfway in this toad turn to follow Old Roan Chase and Mornay's Garden, dual winner of the race. Draws to this playing fence, just has to reach for it, took off half a stride too soon. Tartak in fifth place, perhaps a little unsighted, almost jumping into the quarters of I'm Singing the Blues, but at five of them covered by only three lengths, watch my back, the only one a little out of touch. Into the next turn they go, Mornay's Garden. From Alberta's run in the hands of AP Wider Pocana and Barry Geraghty. I'm singing the blues. Tom Scudamore with the green sleeves and cap, and then Tartak under Paddy Brennan. Watch my back remains 10 lengths away. Back where they started from. A further eight fences to jump. Four of them coming in rapid fire down the back straight. And Monet's Garden perhaps just given a breather in front. He stacks them up once more in his tail. Pocana and Alberta's run close up. Monet's Garden slick there. Tartak landing a little steeply. Out jumped for fourth by I'm Singing the Blues. Watch My Back continues in last place, eight lengths adrift. Moving on towards the 10th, Monet's Garden. Alberta's run Pocala. I'm Singing the Blues. Tartak in fifth and a accurate leap from the leader, Monet's Garden. They send a few seagulls scattering, moving on towards another ditch. Monet's Garden from Alberta's run out wide. Pocala yet to be popped the question. Alberta's run booted into that one. I'm singing the blues, the nosebanders travel comfortably. Tartak is a couple of lengths off and watch my back bustled along, still in last place. This completes the jumping in the back straight. Five from home, Monet's Garden a length up on landing from I'm Singing the Blues, Pocala down at the running rail. McCoy just nudging away on Alberta's run, Tartak working into it on the inside as they race down the side of the course and on towards the fourth from home. So still five of them covered by a little more than three lengths. Monet's Garden trying to uh, shake off their challengers. Pocala down the inside, I'm Singing the Blues in the center. Still McCoy nudging away on Alberta's run. Then Tartak, I'm Singing the Blues, crashes out when holding every chance. Monet's Garden stalked around the final turn by Pocala. Tartak and Alberta's run a couple of lengths down. The old boy then uh, straightens for home with three left to jump Monet's Garden. But Pocala seemingly waiting in the wings. Barry Geraghty exuding confidence. Brennan's nudging away on Tartak in third. Then Alberta's run. Still Monet's Garden, but only a length up on landing. 
Pocola still to be asked a serious question. Now ranges up to challenge. Tartak has got three lengths to find, and then Alberta's run. Monet's Garden, the last ditch, two from home, came up, led by a half length from Pocola. Now Geraghty has to nudge away, and the old boy finds a bit more. Monet's Garden on the run down towards the final fence. Pocola switched out to have another go at him. They've drawn well away from Tartak, so Pocola trying to spoil the Monet's Garden party as he ranges up towards the final fence. Pocola and Monet's Garden as one. It could be all on the jumping. Monet's Garden the far side by a whisker from Pocola. Monet's Garden goes off up the run in. A length up. Pocola is digging in bravely for Geraghty's urchings, but Monet's Garden is finding plenty for Dougie Costello. A final thrust from Pocola. Not enough. Back at his beloved entry, and it's three old roan chases for Monet's Garden. Pocola's back in second. Tartak third. Then Alberta's run. And finally, watch my back.